hello everyone now we already assigned the relationship between the tables in the previous video now we will put that data in our second table now we all know whenever we want to maintain that data in that table we have to generate a table maintenance generator so i'll go to change button utilities table maintenance generator i will pass the authorization group we already covered what is the meaning of this authorization group i will pass the function group same as that of table name i'll go for one step i will click on find screen number overview screen automatically appear now i will generate the table maintenance generator so my tmg is successfully generated now we will maintain that data into this second table with the help of sm30 transaction code this is my table and i will click on maintain button now we will just go for better understanding i will click on new entries now in my order header table if i will show you my order header table i have only the order number 125 now you already assigned the relationship between the tables it means whatever the order numbers are in the order header table you can only only pass those order number into this particular table how because you assign the relationship between the tables primary key of that table is acting as a foreign key into this table it is checking whatever the order number is in your independent table you can only put those order number here so if you see the help you can see only 1 to 5 are there suppose if i forcefully put 6 and you can see i am clearly getting a error that 6 is not available in your independent table or primary key table so if you want to put 6 order number firstly you have to maintain in your primary key table or your independent table so it means i can only only put the order number from 1 to 5 in this particular table i'll go for new entries and i will simply paste this data copy this data and i will paste into this particular table now i am able to put all the data and i am going for save button and you can see only order number 1 to 5 are allowed because 1 to 5 are in your header table and why i am able to put a duplicate records of a order number because these two are the primary keys of this particular table so in this particular whole previous videos we created a header table we inserted data into header table after that we created a item table but whenever you are creating a item table please please assign the relationship with the header table because 
your item table should only accept that data which is in your header table because there is no no existence of your dependent table if you do not have a independent table yes sir your primary foreign key relationship is very very necessary because if you will not go for a relationship you will put anything here and that will result into a data inconsistency so that's it in this particular video we will go for the new topics in the upcoming videos thank you